Hi guys, this is Catch Queen and uh, today I'm taking a look at uh, my biggest breast forms ever, or rather a uh, new uh, G cup, I think it's G cup, breast plate from Ronnie A. Now I got this plate because um, you guys know the trouble I've been having with uh, breast plates uh, that uh, I already have, uh, you know I have a D cup one and um, yeah, well the breasts are a little bit too close together and uh, you know with the wider shoulders being a cross dresser and all uh, it uh, just the image that it creates just is not ideal as far as I'm concerned and I'm hoping that while these babies seem to be pretty close together as well uh, being bigger they will fill up this uh, chest area uh, much better and uh, give a much better impression so and being tall and all that uh, does actually mean that uh, you know you need to rock uh, bigger a uh, pair of tatas to uh, kind of make a difference. So uh, yeah, so I'm going to give these bigs a try. These are G cup breastplates from Ronnie A. And uh, yeah, today we are taking a closer look at them. I uh, hope you guys are gonna like them as uh, much as I'm gonna like them because uh, yeah, I'm really hoping that these will make a difference in the way that I um, cross dress. So. Uh, yeah, my first impressions, well, this is the package, I haven't unboxed them at all yet. Now, um, just before I begin a word about Ronnie, these guys are, uh, like, you know, it's their real premier source of cross-dressing paraphernalia. Uh, you just order something online and they're sending along in a few days' time, uh, regardless of whether you're in Europe or in the U.S. And uh, if you're in Europe or in the U.S., they have local warehouses, so you don't have to uh, mess about with uh, bureaucracy and with, uh, you know, customs paperwork. So, uh, yeah. Uh, they send them, they send them uh, your products locally. So uh, yeah, there's that. So I got this in uh, I, think, I think about three days time, and uh, yeah, it's a super heavy package. Now these weigh more around six kilograms uh, or five kilograms and, and a half, something like that, and they are absolutely heavy. I'm sweating just holding on to them here while I'm talking. So uh, yeah. Uh, Anyway, without any further ado, let us see what is inside the box so I don't have to hold on to it like this anymore. <laughs> the bad news for me is that I'm going to have to unbox them standing up. So, uh, yeah, my struggles are just beginning, <laughs> weight-wise. So, uh, yeah, well, anyway, uh, the first impression is that they're heavy. So these are going to be a chore to wear. Uh, well, hopefully not, since, uh, you know, once they're on your body, the weight kind of distributes and, uh, yeah, you don't... Uh, it's not like, uh, you know, holding them out in front of yourself like this. So, um, yeah, I'm really, really curious to see what, uh, what this package contains. Alright guys, so uh, here I am. I have a pair of tiny scissors with me. And I'm going to try to unbox these babies. Which, uh, I'm probably not going to be able to do standing up. But, uh, anyway, let's just give it a try. Nah, it's not going to work. Let's try it sitting down. Gotta rearrange my whole camera setup for that. All right, guys. So here is the heavy package, and uh, yeah, let's uh, let me try to unbox these babies. I do believe that there is another box uh, inside, as Ronnie used um, stylish boxes to um, to send their merchandise, and this one. Just plain old brown. Yeah, indeed. There is our. I can already see it. There is a uh, nice little box on the inside. Which I hope I'm going to be able to extract without any kind of problems. And the other one? Mm, not really. <laughs> here we go. Yeah, I'm wrestling with this. Oh, here we go. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> yeah, Let's get rid of that one. <laughs> Alright, so this is the Ronnie um, G Cup breastplate that I am going to um, unbox and review for you guys and try them on, of course, as well. So, uh, these, as you can see, the box is Ronnie A's trademark, uh, you know, bow decorated, uh, stylish little, um, you know, uh, box with a, with a golden Ronnie inscription on it. So yeah, there it is. And uh, yeah, so without any further ado, and it is uh, sealed. It is uh, 
it is sealed uh, in, it is plastic wrapped and sealed so vacuum sealed so I'm going to try to remove this as well and see what we have inside now as you guys probably know I can't show you the um, nipple area of the breast forms so I'm going to have to take special care in that respect but uh, yeah still I'm going to be able to uh, provide give you a general idea about how heavy this thing is and about how big it looks all right so here's the package out of the plastic wrapper and uh, yeah let's remove the lid excellent well the nipples are it, it's it's nipples up but they're pretty well covered so I suppose I can show them to you like this and uh, yeah uh, try to uh, make it so that you guys can't see the nipples as I want to remove these from the package and well there's a ziplock bag they're in the ziplock bag so yeah now the nipples are facing toward me so uh, it's not going to be a problem it's a ziplock bag and there's another plastic bag on the inside so yeah unboxing this is quite a chore <laughs> I can't really I don't know where to grab them Oh my god, goodness gracious, I want to ruin that. Oh my god, these are huge guys. Oh my, oh my god. They barely lift them. Ooh. It's a handful to deal with all this wrapping material. I'm gonna toss the box a little bit aside as well. There. And oh my goodness gracious, these are massive. These are massive, like these are indeed hands down the biggest, by far the biggest breast forms I've ever had and I'm really really curious if I can, you know, um, wear them. I'm going to put the scissors far away so I don't hurt them, I don't want to draw silicone here, they're silicone filled. I don't want to draw silicone here. And, oh my god. Now these are indeed EO. Oh my god, these are massive. These are, oh my god. They're oiled up or something. They feel oily to the touch. But yeah, here we go. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So, yeah, oh my god, well, these are almost unmanageably giant, oh, look at that, and they are a little bit oily indeed, you got some on my shiny pants here, and it smells a little bit um, vinegary, a little bit weird, oh my god, guys, I don't know how I'm going to put these on, oh my goodness, great. look at that, just look at that. Oh my god. Oh, AMG. I'm gonna have to cover up the nipples. I'm gonna cover them up with my hands to give you a better look. There you go. Oh my god, I can barely hold them up. Woo! These are massive, guys. Alright, so, yeah. Now, I'm gonna go try them on and see if I can find a uh, top or anything uh, that I can squeeze them under. <laughs> any kind of, uh, you know, a dress or uh, a top like this. The reason I took this rather conservative-ish looking top is because, um, yeah, I knew that I had to squeeze something massive under them. Under them. So, uh, yeah. All right, guys, so uh, these are my Ronnie G cup uh, breast forms or breastplate. I'm wearing uh, it right now and I'm going to have to tell you it was quite a chore to, to squeeze into it. Uh, the neck area, I'm going to have to trim that a little bit, but that is always, uh, you know, up to you to trim it uh, the way you uh, feel comfort comfy with it. And, uh, yeah, so here they are. Look at how they uh, bounce. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, they are, they are giant, they're huge, and I do not believe that you can appreciate their true size uh, from um, that camera angle right there, but I'm going to give you a side view that'll possibly make your jaws drop because uh, these are truly massive indeed so uh, yeah here we go 
Oh my god. Oh, oh my goodness gracious. Look at them. Look at them. Look. So that's how big they are. See? They are massive. They are giant. And uh, yeah, I do kind of love them. Uh, as heavy as they are, once you put them on, uh, as I had anticipated, the weight, uh, you know, sort of just distributes all over your uh, upper body and uh, you don't really actually feel it anymore. And they are kind of comfortable. So, uh, they're at least as comfortable as my D-cups. So, uh, in that regard, no, I can't have any kind of complaints. I don't have any kind of complaints. Look at how busty I've become. <laughs> like, uh, they're a, bit, a little bit too big. In that sense, I reckon from the side, I look a little bit out of proportion. I would need a massive giant bum to uh, compensate for these babies. But alas, that's all I'm rocking. <laughs> yeah, so uh, that's all the junk I'm packing in the trunk. <laughs> so yeah, guys, uh, well, um, what else is there to say about these babies? They're silicon filled, so that's why they're so heavy and bouncy, so they're quite realistic, they feel realistic, and uh, yeah, uh, Ronnie always prompt with their service, uh, you know, they sent them along uh, extremely quickly, I was surprised to receive them uh, that fast, despite the fact that uh, you know, this whole purchase happened during the holiday season, and uh, yeah, well, these are great, I don't know if I can, um, you know, actually, uh, wrestle in them or use them for physical activity or uh, you know uh, they I don't believe that they will actually make your back hurt like the Ronnie folks told me that they are so heavy that they might make my back uh, hurt but uh, yeah I guess that could happen if you were to wear these all day long but that's obviously not the case here so um, yeah as far as I'm concerned these babies rock and uh, width wise well, they are a little bit too, a little, little bit close together, as you can see. So I can barely slide my hand in between them. But being so big, their width is actually uh, quite uh, pretty much in line with uh, my shoulder width. So uh, in that regard, yes, I can say that my calculations were correct, mm -hmm. more or less so. And uh, yeah, well, um, uh, that's all I have for you guys today. Uh, <clears throat> you know, check out Ronnie M. They're uh, your premier destination for uh, cross dressing paraphernalia products. You know, breastplate, breast forms. They've got all sorts of uh, more extreme stuff like whole body suits. And uh, ooh, holy shit, I shudder just uh, thinking about how you would actually slide into one of those. It'll probably take you upwards to upwards of half an hour to uh, get into one of their suits, uh, one of their full body suits. But uh, yeah. You can find anything there, so uh, you know whatever rings your bell, you can probably find it at Ronnie. Now, what I am gonna do, guys, I'm gonna try to uh, you know slip into a bathing suit, like one of my bigger ones, because I got a couple, a couple, I got like a handful that are a little bit too big for me normally. And you guys know that I really love those really tiny tight ones, uh, so uh, I'm gonna get one of these bigger ones and uh, you know give them a go. So if I do manage to slide into one of them, uh, I'm going to do a little bit of modeling for you. Wearing my bathing suit and these absolutely giant breast forms from Ronnie. Be right back. Alright guys, so uh, as you can see, I did manage to squeeze into a bathing suit. Now this, normally this bathing suit is huge for me, but now it seems like it just suits me fine. So uh, you can take a better look at uh, my Ronnie H. I think these are H cups, and you know why I think so? I mean, I know I've been saying G cup all through, through this video, but um, I, you know, something escaped my attention. I um, found a little bit of an, an envelope on the bottom of the package, and uh, yeah, as I opened it, guess what it says here? It says Ronnie H cup, so yeah, I'm dumb. Well, anyway, so these are Ronnie H cups, they're huge. And I'm going to give you a side view, just to kind of sort of be able to tell how big they really are. Um, if I don't put my hand here and, uh, you know, try to, to pull my bathing suit in a little bit, it's going to look a bit like this. 
and I'm gonna seem like I have a huge belly going. <laughs> well, well, you know, these are the drawbacks of giant tatas, I suppose. Um, so, uh, yeah, what else do we have in this uh, little envelope here? Let's see. Something hard. Like, uh, oh, it says Ranier.com, follow Ranier on YouTube. So, yeah, check him out. Um, and uh, it says here service at Ranier.com, that's their email address. And, uh, yeah, wow, there's some more stuff in here. Some more goodies. What is this? Instructions. Oh my goodness gracious. Yeah, you do need instructions to wear these babies, that's for sure. These aren't for beginners. How do you look? Oh yeah, there you go. You have illustrations on how to put them on. And uh, yeah, it says here cross-dressing courses and skills. Course.runia.com. Check this out, guys, if you need, uh, you know, to uh, take your cross-dressing to a higher level, these guys can help you out. And uh, yeah, well, let's put them neatly back in here. And take a look at the instructions, because I'm a little bit intrigued by these. The instructions. Demonstration wearing headgear. Oh yeah, they do sell masks as well, so uh, I'm, I'm, I don't really like those, so uh, I'm not interested. So if you're going to put on any breastplate of theirs, put something over your head. Now, you can put a, uh, you know, uh, a pantyhose leg or something, so it doesn't pull on your hair, because if you don't, it is an absolute nightmare to pull it over your head, as this, um, you know, silicone material is uh, pretty sticky, and uh, if you do put a little bit of powder on it, it is going to, uh, you know, pull at your hair, so that's not fun. Clean the product with water and shampoo before first try-on. Oopsie, I just tried them on like that. Oh, dry it naturally or with a towel. Don't hang the breast or press it too hard, obviously. And uh, be especially careful for your first try-on. Don't stretch it too hard. Edge and zipper part are very vulnerable. So, yeah, there is that. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, if you do, I think a phone number here as well. And, uh, yeah, well, these guys are getting more and more professional every time I uh, get something from them. So, uh, yeah, Ronnie, I suppose that is the way to go if you like cross-dressing and giant silicone breasts. What else can I say? These, I I'm absolutely surprised that, they, they, uh, that I managed to squeeze them into this bathing suit as large as it is. So, uh, yeah, well, guys, <laughs> that's it for today. <laughs> uh, yeah, I hope you like my review, and uh, if you do, well, stick around and, uh, you know, check out the other videos that I post here on my channel, Catch Queen. Check me out here on my other social media channels, and, uh, you know, ring that bell button, subscribe to my channel, you know, all that jazz. See you around.